Good morning, Castaic. I'm Henry Sundell, and I'm happy to welcome you to our first episode of 2021. We have some great segments for you today. We meet a fellow coyote in our student spotlight and find out what's happening with some announcements. Then we have a fun trivia segment followed by the weather forecast for this week. Plus, we are introducing a new segment for this semester, Coyote of the Week. Now get ready, because Good Morning Castaic starts now. Thanks for joining us today. I don't know about you, but that winter break was just what I needed. It was nice to have some time off from staring at Zoom so I could spend my time staring at video games. I did take a moment to reflect on 2020 and what changes I hope 2021 brings. Dunstan Leogo chatted with Kylie Price about her hopes for the new year in this week's Student Spotlight. Let's take a look. Hey Coyotes, I'm Dunstan Joseph Leogo and today, we're checking in on Kylie Price, a student here at Castic High School to see how she's going into the new year and the changes she wants to make to better herself. How's it going, Kylie? Tell us a little bit about yourself. Um, my name is Kylie Price and I'm 14 years old um, and I attend Castic High School. Um, some of my hobbies are I play piano, I play volleyball, and um, I like writing sometimes. What do you think your most notable accomplishments of 2020 are? Um, my most notable accomplishments were probably earlier this year um, when I was still attending Castaic Middle School. And there was an end of the year art contest called the Legacy Project. And I won that. It took me like uh, maybe two to three days to finish the entire piece. Um, also this year, um, about a month ago, I started a debate club with my friends. What do you think is the most important thing to improve upon yourself going into the new year? The most important thing is probably that I want to improve myself, um, like going into the new year, is probably why I want to end off the semester with like um, straight A's. Um, also, I don't know if we're going to have volleyball tryouts for the volleyball team here yet, but if we do, I want to get on the volleyball team. Um, also, for Christmas, my parents wanted me to play them a piano song, but I might finish that maybe um, in 2021. So, What else do you want to accomplish in 2021? In 2021, um, I also want to finish off the... Um, I guess like ninth grade um, with straight A's and I also kind of want to write like a script or maybe like start writing a little bit more. I also want to read um, more books. Thank you so much for that Kylie. Unfortunately that's all the time we have for today. It's nice to know that we have some people going into the new year with a fresh mindset. Reporting for Good Morning Castake, I'm Dunstan Joseph Yogo. Great interview, Dunstan. It's great to know a little more about our fellow coyote, especially when we can't meet face to face right now. Santa Grable has this week's announcements to keep us informed of everything happening at CHS. Welcome coyotes to our first announcement segment of the semester. I'm Xander Grable. Let's waste no time at all and hop right in. Monday, January 11th was National Clean Off Your Desk Day, but it's never too late to get organized. Please see this clean off your desk document for some useful tips and create your own before and after messy versus organized. Learn how you can help a friend. Suicide prevention training is available on Wednesday, January 27th at 2 p.m. All Heart District students may participate in a mindfulness workshop on Wednesday, January 20th at 1.30 p.m. As for club news, Castaic High School's Anime Club is virtually back. Join us every Friday from 1 p.m. to 1.40 p.m. on Zoom as we enjoy all the anime has to offer. Email club president Brandon Doe at 9904-5768 at my.heartdistrict.org for the Zoom link. Short and sweet. That does it for these announcements. See you next time, coyotes. 
Thanks for all that good information, Xander. Ooh, that sound means it's time for some trivia. Let's see what Jacob Calderon has for us today. I'm gonna say like 2009. Um, hell. <laughs> Snow White? Europe. Hmm, that was interesting. Thanks for that, Jacob. I'm pleased to announce a brand new segment on GMC, Coyote of the Week. Our coyotes are each amazing in different ways. To honor this, each week, a teacher will nominate a student for his or her individual achievement. Coyotes of the Week will receive a personalized certificate with the reason their teacher honored them and a $15 gift card to Barnes & Noble, courtesy of Logic's Credit Union. Without further delay, let's see who our very first Coyote of the Week is. nominated you for Coyote of the Week. Uh, so, thank you. I nominated you because of your um, persistence. You've been in tutor time far more than anyone else. Um, you don't let yourself fail, which I think is a very admirable, qual admirable quality, which will get you very far. And so um, I wanted to recognize that. So we've been, I've nominated you and uh, keep rocking it. You're doing a great job. Thank you. Congratulations, Tayton, on being selected as the very first Coyote of the Week. Up next is Blythe Walker with the weather report. Blythe? Good morning, Coyotes. I'm here with your weather report. Starting with Monday, we have a high of 75 and a low of 51. Tuesday, a high of 64 and a low of 46. Wednesday, a high of 68 and a low of 44. Thursday, a high of 66 and a low of 45. And finally, Friday, with a high of 62 and a low of 43. I hope you all have a fabulous week, and as always, stay safe. I'm Blythe Walker, reporting for Good Morning Castaic. Looks like another week of pleasant weather. Thanks, Blythe. That brings another episode of Good Morning Castaic to an end. Make sure to check out our Twitter and Instagram pages at GM Castaic for show replays and exclusive content. You can also watch replays of our shows on our YouTube channel. Thank you so much for tuning in. This has been Henry Swindell for Good Morning Castaic.